Get a fabric couch, they said. It'll be fun, they said. Super fun. Shave my couch. Real, real fun. Dig this life? Dig it. Just driving around. This is what our outings consist of nowadays. <laughs> Just driving around. Nowhere to go. What? She doesn't even let me water my plant. Please look at how ugly this plant is compared to all of the other ones. got more babies hey guys what is up it is Monday July 6th I am about to put somewhat of a decent face on. Oh, wow, I haven't dried my clothes today. Always good. Gonna die. The more time I spend kind of still in quarantine, the less I want to uh, interact with people. Here in Florida, they're about to reclose things because people don't know how to act. So I do not claim any of the Floridians that think that masks are going to kill them i don't claim any of them and that's all i gotta say about that so this is the sunscreen that i've been wearing it's the color science some forgettable total protection spf 50 it has a little bit of a tint the tint is light it's good for me right now but the moment i get any kind of a tan it's just gonna be way 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 too light for me i don't know i just really love this formula and it doesn't break me out uh, my skin is very sensitive to certain sunscreens. I'm pretty sure it's titanium dioxide in like higher doses. Doses? Doses. Wow. And I've had coffee today. Uh, yeah. I think I'm allergic to titanium dioxide in like higher doses. Nobody cares. And this it's mostly zinc oxide. So I'm obsessed with this. I also wanted to rant about how insane the world is but i think we're all aware i don't think i have to go into it anymore than i have already gone into it in the past like seven videos that i've done so i'm going to try with all of my heart to vlog as consistently as i can like every day so that i have enough footage every week or every two weeks to post a vlog instead of waiting like an entire month to post my vlogs so i'm going to try to do that this week i really want to have a vlog up like every two or three videos but the problem is that i'm not doing a whole lot in you know my house but i'll try my best so just bear with me as i try to get my mojo back so i talked about this in my favorites this is what i've been using to set my face it's the adaptogen soothe and hydrate activated mist by youth to the people and it just leaves your skin so glowy and your makeup looks like skin when you're done. I will say that you do have to like blot your T-zone or set your T-zone after this because otherwise your skin might look a little too glowy when you walk outside. But so far, I really like it. It just smells kind of weird. Thank you for your time. I'm wearing this very old tank which is like a knitted material from Zara I think it's like literally like six or seven years old and my Nanine trousers with my Proenza Birkenstocks for my hair even though my hair is not dirty today I just put it up in like a clip 
and put a headband on because it's like a thousand degrees outside and I don't want to go through that I don't want to have my hair down so yeah uh, earrings are from love AJ let's freaking go to the post office exciting times by the way these are already like basically full-grown adults look at them these birds grow so fast do not recommend hate it already way too hot way too hot so I lost the mask that I had purchased from shop McMullen I'm very upset about it because that mask was so comfortable compared to all of these other masks so I'm contemplating on going and signing up to another gym because my gym went out of business so I have to find another gym because I'm so tired of working out at home I need some weights in my life there was like a lightning bolt that landed right next to me almost died by the way there was nobody in the parking lot Hence why I took off my mask. Thank you so much. It's about to pour. And I almost got struck by lightning. So there's that. Fun times. Good thing the girl was kind enough. And she's like, are you sure you want to sign up? We're closing again on Wednesday. I had completely forgotten that they're closing everything up again. She could have easily taken my money, but she didn't. That's why. I appreciate her so yeah we're just gonna go home because the universe doesn't want us to be out Time now. I've been editing for like I don't even know. I lost track of time. As you can see, I'm stressed. Party size. My computer crashes every 10 minutes, so it takes me forever to edit a video. I got some stuff from a brand called Peace and Quiet or Museum of Peace and Quiet. Um, so I got this hat and I got this tote. So this is the tote. It's pretty big. It just says naturalist. It's cute. I've been really into canvas totes lately because they just hold everything. For today's outfit, this crew neck is old from Everlane. Tank top. I can't remember where it's from. Pants are from the Frankie shop and Proenza Birkenstocks and just like a forest green bag from pollen which i can fit my life in and earrings i get a lot of questions on these earrings they're from etsy they're really old but if you just search clear hoop earrings on there you'll find a bunch of earrings just like these egg so I need to tackle a couple of things in the house I need to find more storage in this house I've talked about this before I only have this closet back here which is a walk-in closet that I share with Roger it's a very narrow space and the only other storage in this house is the laundry room which has my washer and dryer in it so it's not like a lot of space to work with this house doesn't have a lot of storage so I need to figure out the laundry room situation. We want to get a new washer dryer and I want to kind of plan and organize the entire like laundry closet. So yeah, I'll show you guys that whole process once I get started with it because it's such a small space. So I really need to make the most of it.
I have been using my Chanel Sculpting Balm. I've talked about this before a million times. I'm pretty sure it's been our favorites. And I can't stress how much I love this thing. Like, it just leaves the most beautiful, natural glow. In my favorites video, a couple of you asked me about my makeup. And this is what I've been doing. I've been getting this blush, which is the Fit Me Medium Coral Blush. I don't even know if they still make this. <laughs> I am the queen of expired makeup. I just use so many old products. <laughs> It's not even funny because when I really like something, I just find it really hard to switch. So I just get this and I use it as an eyeshadow. And I just put it all over my lid and on my uh, lower eye. Then I do my faux wing and call it a day. It's super easy. I also use this as blush. If I don't use this one as my blush, I use Max So Natural Glow Play Blush. Today I'll use this one though. And then I go in with NARS Blonde Venus Lipstick, which is like an orangey nude shade. And it's just like a monochromatic orange bronzy look. Doesn't have the best pigmentation in the world, but I make it work. It's just like the prettiest peachy orangey shade like do you guys see it i don't know if this camera's gonna pick it up i recently watched the great on hulu and i really liked it it's really funny it's kind of like a period drama but with a twist a modernized period drama which period dramas are my favorite and the fact that they modernized it i usually don't like it when they modernize it but in this case i do i think it was really tasteful the actors are amazing and I loved it oh my god there's a huge lizard like dinosaur in my backyard okay first of all why is your mouth open like that oh my god he's actually a genius because he's sitting next to this right here which emits carbon dioxide which attracts bugs and he's just chilling, just like freeloading off this little trap that we have right here. So this guy is a genius and I respect him. He can live back here all he wants if he's going to help me with my mosquito situation. So I recently got this dress from the Frankie shop. It's just like a baby doll type of dress. And it's adjustable so you can like expand it if you want and super cute for like the beach and stuff or just to wear in this hot miami heat so it's what i'm gonna wear today to film do you guys see what i mean by this sunscreen being just way too light for me like i don't know if it's gonna pick up on camera but my face is so pale <laughs> compared to like my shoulders so i wish that look at that i wish they made a darker color because i just look so one dimensional <laughs> so we'll see but yeah i'm gonna use this dress today because it's so airy and it's just too hot and lately i've been filming in front of my window so it's like even hotter and i have to turn off the ac I'm wearing my octave jewelry earrings i have to edit i have to edit this vlog I'm already procrastinating it. You see, this is why I can't have weekly vlogs up. I'm just a one woman show and I, I just can't do everything that I have to do in time. Is it too hot, buddy? It's too hot. Okay, so this is my laundry closet. Please excuse it. This is what I want to try to tackle. I want to put some shelving up here. I have to move this to the loft. This is my backdrop stuff foam roller all of that i have to find another place for it this is literally like one out of the two closets that i have in my house so that's why i have such a, like a mess going on i want to put some shelving up here to put my detergents and stuff and clear up this space i have no other place for this so it has to stay there i want to get the little bar that you could just clip 
your broom and your mops and your vacuum on for this side i'll probably order that today on amazon just fix this whole situation like it's really bothering me and yeah we're gonna get a new washer dryer this is very old it came with the house probably have to get the washer and dryer before i do anything else because i have to measure everything so yeah this is that's what we're gonna do um probably next week so this is everything that i just finished talking about in my skincare routine so i did do a lot of honorable mentions and i gave like different options for each thing of course i have that very annoying habit of rambling about other options so that's why there's like so much but even then it's still so much like you think you're pretty low maintenance until you put all of your skincare in a box it was like a thousand degrees outside and then all of a sudden it just started raining so welcome to miami ladies and gentlemen nowadays and Roger took me to a road that is full of holes and his car there is a hole <laughs> his car sounds like it's about to fall apart so this is what we've been doing for the past like 15 fine. minutes and it's about to rain let's test out the stabilization on this more, camera more <laughs> we've seen some ducks we've seen a really cool horse we saw a bunch of roosters, some chickens, we saw a dog. Ducks with babies. Yeah, little baby ducks. Oh, the rain's getting heavy. We got some cows. Can we take them home? Because they look a little miserable there. stuff from Amazon these are the multivitamin gummies that I take along with my b12 gummies I just needed to restock this I got another new face gel primer the first one that I had was the smaller one which came with the new face which is my little facial toning device and I went through that really quickly because you have to apply a lot of it so got another one they sell it on Amazon and for the laundry organization that I'm gonna do probably next week I got this little guy to hold my brooms and my mops and all of that good stuff so I'll let you guys know how I like it once I install it or Roger installs it and it's raining so I got this little gel nail polish remover and it's supposed to um, remove your gel nail polish three hours later it does work but you have to keep applying coats well I guess it depends on what gel you use but I guess the gel that I use or the gel that my nail tech uses is like hardcore very thick gel so it takes like a bunch of coats of this but 
for the most part it's a lot healthier to do it with this than to soak it off with acetone yeah i would rather do it with this now i'm just gonna probably do like one more coat because i still have some little areas that have and then i'm gonna do a quick manicure Okay, I feel like the lighting is trash, but I just finished lightly buffing them and then polishing them and I put my OPI Nail Envy and then I'm just gonna go in with OPI's Chiffon of You and my top coat, which is the out the door and my drying drops. And that's what I do for my at-home manicure.